Oh my god. <laughs> what is going on? Someone's in my house. Hello guys. Recently I asked one of my friends 74 bits what their biggest fear was. They responded with well, their biggest fears. But here's the catch. The reason why I wanted this information was because I was planning to make a custom VR horror game specifically designed to terrify. Him. So with my new knowledge, I opened a VR project and started thinking of how I was going to set it up. Originally, I thought this was going to be easy to set up one simple VR system, but I was wrong and wasted a lot of time. But eventually, I got the basic system working. I'm going to try to improve the system and make it work a little better, so hopefully whenever I do that, it won't take too much time. Alright, I got the stuff to work better, and it feels a lot nicer. Now, it may be like, what, 11pm, but that isn't important because the most crucial part of the game is my friend's fears. So, whenever I asked him, he said that his biggest fears were dark, spooky, smart, scary, Larry alien abduction. Now when I first saw that, I was very confused just like you, but you know what, it's gonna be fine because even though I don't know how to use Unity, I'll figure it out. I opened up paint and drew some reference images for the game. I also made a Trello with all of the mechanics that I'm planning to add. So first thing I need to do was make a flashlight, so I opened up Blender and created a cube and uh... Oh, right, uh, yeah, I don't know how to model. Now, this is a big problem since you won't have a game without models or objects. So, the good thing is that I know a little bit about modeling, but it'll have to be simple. Whoa, look at this flashlight. When you use your trigger, it turns on and does some cool stuff, and then it goes back to normal whenever you let it go. It just needs some improvement. I updated the flashlight and added batteries. Then, after a few hours of struggling, I finished the house. Although it is quite broken whenever I try to add textures you can see here. I also had to manually add collision to the house model. Hours that I could have spent on something better I spent on making walls be walls and stop you from going through the wall. Well, it's for a good cause. I added some textures and I kinda had a deal of how horrible the wall texture is, but I'll probably fix it later. Added some atmosphere, fixed an issue with the flashlight, and made a sad looking door. I then improved the door and made it door. I then added the objective system and finished the main story of the game, and I fixed more bugs and then made the main spooky character for the game. Behold, Scary Larry, deformed. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty proud of it, but it does look like something that I can't quite put my finger on. Anyway, I refined it and made the game look better with more models. Although, going through the process of building the game and having it play standalone at a stable frame rate caused it to lose a lot of its quality, and I did not record the game before it lost its quality. All of that was around a month's work of... work. What? <laughs> All of that was around a month's worth of work for me. It probably makes sense though, because I never made a game in Unity before, <laughs> but at least I'm done with the game. I patched up any bugs that could be breaking the game, and then I sent the game off to my friend. Let's see what happens. Hey, can I just complete this without glasses? Oh, it's locked. Oh, that's not good. Oh, my favorite thing. This is very silly. Dog. I guess I have a dog now. I have a flashlight. Extras. What is that? Maybe I shouldn't leave my door open. Oh, I forgot what my dog looks like. Man. Oh my goodness, what was that? I think it's probably my eyes playing tricks on me again. Mm, these batteries are going. I sure do look yummy. What happened? <laughs> this is very scary. Find the lock. Ooh, hmm. oh, here it is. Lock the front door. Well, that's probably a good idea. I wonder what happened to that. <laughs> Your voices. Probably take my med soon. Da -da 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 -da. Good night. I don't like that sound. Oh, wow, this is this is very silly. Huh? <laughs> oh. No. Did it stop?
That was so spooky. I love how I can just see my hands like this. Pretty silly game. Pretty spooky. To be honest, I wasn't expecting him to get scared at all. And because I didn't want to leave the game in the dust and show it to only one of my friends, I decided to have my friend Parker play it too. Why can I see my hands? It's so silly. Get green and stay alive. You wake up in a sweat. Okay. Why is everything so blurry? Book. Let me get oh, glasses. There you go. In investigate the noise. Uh, uh, uh. I'm going back to bed, fool. Yeah. 12:15 a.m. Huh. Light switch. No light switch isn't even work. Light. Dude, your lights don't have functionality, bro. Close the door. Mm. Oh my god, it's Kevin! Nice llama, very distorted llama. Why do I have so many plates if I'm living in a single house? This is ridiculous. Whoa! Oh my god, why have a basement? Well, I guess I'm going back to bed. <sighs> Get out of here. Clean. Bro! I don't want to clean right now! Are you serious? Oh my god, that's, oh, that's tasty, yo! Dude! <laughs> There's more! Dude, where? This is to my room. No light switch because it doesn't work for some reason. Watch this. I was literally. I, it's a wooden laundry machine. That doesn't work. <clears throat> uh, whoa. Why am I doing my laundry at 12 in the morning? Wait, where's the flashlight? Where? Am I just that blind? Bro! Why do I have so many plates? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, forty. Why don't I have 48 plates for one single person? This is the weakest flashlight in my entire life, yo. Find the dog. I got you. Hello, Charles. Where are you, boy? What? Yo, I think I might just go inside. I think Charles is dead, yo. Is that scary, Larry? You are devastated and con- Oh! <laughs> I didn't even see anybody! <laughs> Why? Why? How can you do this thing? Oh, wait, I'm gonna turn it off. Okay. <laughs> Find a lock. I didn't give anybody! I hate you! I'm just kidding, I love you. Oh, there's a lock. What's going on, yo? Yeah, my house, my house, yo. Place under him. <laughs> what is going on? Someone's in my house. Oh, no one's in my closet. <laughs> You're not scoring for tentacles. Get out of my house. What kind of sleep paralysis demon is this, bro? Whoop num gum num style. Oh, 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 oh. Get green and stay. That was pretty good. I actually kind of liked it. I love you. I'm gonna speed on it. That was an experience. If you guys want to play this for yourself, it should be on App Lab. Here's like the screen for it. Anyway, I enjoy you guys being here and watching this. Although this was my first time making a game in a different game engine that I'm not used to and scrapping a ton of things. It turned out decent. But if you want me to do more game development, let me know by giving advice, support, and also considering clicking the subscribe button. I spent roughly a month or so working on this project, so it has been the biggest video I've ever made in terms of off camera. Have a good day.